代々木のメイン飛び込まれきった It's、uh, in Japan. It's, it's a big country, right? So they're not doing. I mean, aside from you know, TVs and radios and whatever, they're doing their own thing. But the family is just gonna keep it really small, crazy bee, and do their family thing at, at home. They're not doing anything here in Guam. I think me and Nori had a lot of plans for the garden. He had a lot of plans for Guam. Although he was dying, he was still fucking. He was thinking for. He was thinking the next five, ten years for his kids. So. So I, I feel, you know, like you know, him dying here in Guam and and passing in my place, you know what I mean, and and I feel that it's, you know, I mean, if if I didn't do this, not no one would have done it, you know. And I don't think Nori wanted to be mourned; he wanted to be celebrated, you know. And he was a he was a happy dude, you know what I mean. So he didn't want to he didn't want nothing sad. So you know, we don't we're not doing no rosaries. We're not, you know, we're just we got music. We have some good food. We have some good alcohol. And we just want to. Get our close friends and 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 just just you know maybe enjoy their time. You know what I mean. So I never get over it, but I know I'm getting better to you know how to handle this you know thing. So, but I know he always with me somewhere, and then you know <laughs> always again train harder or don't do this, don't do that. Come on, man, get up. You know? He. Wasn't like not you know my coach. He's just my uncle, and I like him so much. But when I started MMA and、uh, he being my coach, I learned lots of things. Not only technique, like for the life and everything. He's like he's like my dad and my brother and my hero. You know. That was really cool and to see like just to remind me like how. How much he's done because he he's not just a wrestler he's not just a fighter he's a hip hop dude he was a curry chef he was he was a reggae dude you know he was into cars you know at rims and sounds I mean you name it you know he was a he he was a model he 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 wore a lot of hats and he and when whatever he did he did it at the at the highest level you know because I was thinking that if I cancel that fight what would he think or you know. What would he tell me? Of course, he's gonna be okay. Why don't you quit? <laughs> you know, so I don't want to let him down. So yeah, I took it. And then I was happy, but also I was really, really sad. It could hit me because I, I guess I was holding till fight's over. It's kind of hit me, and then I just drop. <laughs> you know, I won, but where is he? You know. Is he watching me, or was I okay? Did I okay? Yeah. Yeah. Every like a little thing that what he say, I still, you know, it's in my head, it's in my hair. So I would just teach like, you know, like you're my, you know, I'm telling the kids or my telling my grandkids that I, you know, my brother used to say or used to did. You know. My mom and me fought at the same event, right? And we won both of them, right? That was the first, first like a double win. And Nori always wanted that double win, so we was like, why we couldn't do it like a little bit earlier and then give give him the power? Yeah, that's make me so sad and but still happy. Like I feel like I'm growing up, and I wish you here because. Now I'm really loving MMA, and I start understanding. And I want him right now, like saying like, "Earthen, this and this, watch this and learn this, hold this." Yeah. Before I fucking drink water, eat, or do anything else, I'm massaging him. Right, so I go up, I come in, I start massaging him, and so I, that was my routine with them, and 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 I did that. Fuck, even even when he was able to walk around, so. And you know, I'm massaging him all day, and we're working out, and, and we're, we're 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 training, we're going to the gym, just doing everything to be possibly could to get him strong and healthy. And then,、uh, so now that he's gone, I have this thing that I yeah, sunk him, but I I still do the same. I I go to his, the shrine, I pray, and and I 
and I, I kiss him and you know what I mean and hey bro good night or hey good morning or hey fuck wash the house or if I leave the AO no, my, my kids are here fuck wash the house you know what I mean so I'm constantly talking to him I know it sounds weird but I mean you know I, I not not a lot of people have uh, uh, ashes in their in their house so I mean so that's what I did so it's got no I as, did it really sink in? Yes, but I, I still I feel that he's there. You know what I mean? What well, fuck is he's really literally there, right? So yeah, I talk to him all the time, man. I really thankful. I really appreciate that the um, people still you know care about him and then think about him and then people like message me. You know he's a legend and we love him so much and that makes me um, very happy and I know he's happy. Okay.